Does it make you feel kind of weird being here where Courtney's going to get married? You know, I've been thinking, and what I said before, that's... I'm, I'm sorry. No, it's stupid. But, yeah, I didn't mean I'd rather it. Have I don't you, want I, to feel no, like no, I'm... No, no, I'd rather have you say it than... Yeah, not say it. Okay, I know this is probably pretty weird, but... Courtney and I are over. You know that. I'm with you. I'm not going anywhere. Because I love you. You know what? I gotta catch up on a few things. No. Yeah. Okay. You gonna be okay? Okay. Yeah. I'll meet you in a little while. No, see, I knew it. What are you what? doing? What are you planning? How are you, how are you gonna ruin Courtney's big day? What I'm are you the matron do? of honor. Why does everyone always suspect me of ulterior motives? Gee, uh, I wonder. Hmm. What, what did you, how'd you even know I was here? I, I didn't. I came to see you. She's completely aware that Jax is not my favorite person, but I'm not marrying him. She is. And bottom line, sometimes you have to show up for your friends no matter what. I hope you mean that. Oh, my God. No, really, I really hope you mean that. <laughs> Wait, you're going to give me a complex. All right. You know what? <clears throat> I'm going to go do those errands. Okay. You do that. <sighs> that looks like uh, you're getting the wedding you always dreamed of. You know, I loved our wedding, too. That was good. You know, not big, not a lot of people. Yeah, <laughs> well, that was exactly who we were then. So much has changed, you know? Yeah. You have? Yeah, a lot. Is that because of Jax? Mostly. Jax was, uh, always well, taught me to enjoy life and live in the moment. Not to anticipate disaster. <laughs> That's good. I hope uh, hope we can keep giving you what you need. I'm really glad that you came. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just an emotional wreck right now. It's okay. So um. Did you just come by here to wish me good luck, or was there something else? Oh, yeah, actually, um, it's about Michael. Is he all right? He's still confused over what happened, and he's been having a lot of nightmares. Well, I'm not surprised, considering what he's been through. I mean, being kidnapped, having to deal with AJ and his sick lies, thinking his mother committed murder. Oh, no, 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 I think he, he should have professional help. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. But the thing is, uh, you know, we need someone we can trust to honor Michael's confidence, no matter what he says, okay? And I was just hoping you might be able to find somebody or help us through your foundation. Yeah, absolutely. I, uh, I'll, I'll go through my files. I'll, I'll give you some names, good ones, and it's great, too. Thanks. You know, it would probably be a little weird if I was at your wedding. I understand. Well, good luck. Thanks, Jason. What are you doing here? I, uh, I own the place. Haven't you heard? Shouldn't be getting drunk before your wedding. Oh, there's not going to be a wedding. I know that you were downstairs with Courtney. You're right. It had nothing to do with you. Yeah, I, I agree, and I, I, that's that's why I'm here because I, I realize that it has nothing to do with me. And Courtney's still in love with you, and she'll never get over what it. You, Jax, what are you talking about? She's downstairs right now, getting ready for your wedding. <sighs> I'm sorry, you didn't hear me. Um, I'm, I'm done with Courtney. You, you can have her.
You are gonna marry Courtney today if I have to drag you to the park myself.